room sounds empty because I cleared it out. It's time for the closet to come in. Harlem, we're getting a closet in here. A closet in here. A closet, a closet, a closet in here. Do, 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 do. So yeah, as you can see, I'm super excited. The IKEA delivery guy should be here within the next 10 minutes. I've been waiting all day for him. Um, first, it was, we'll deliver from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. I'm like, dang. Then I get a call and they're like, from 1 p.m. to 5. I'm like, okay, that's, that's a little bit less time. But he literally came right before 5 o'clock. So I've been waiting all day like, is that him? Is that him? Is that him? And it hasn't been him. So he's finally about to come up. The other guy will be here at 5.30, so a little bit shortly after that. So as soon as he brings his stuff in, I'm going to hop in the shower before the next guy gets here. Um, the installer I got off of TaskRabbit. So when you buy something from Ikea, Ikea at checkout will say, oh, do you want, they partner with TaskRabbit and say, oh, do you want to um, hire somebody to come and do this, da, da, da. So through Ikea on the site, it was like, oh, pay $675 to have the people build this. And I'm like, that don't sound right. I was about to pay it, and I was like, that actually don't sound right. Like, TaskRabbit is pretty cheap. So, I went on TaskRabbit. I looked at some of the guys that were available today, literally like a few hours ago. And um, some guy said that he knows how to do IKEA stuff in his bio. I hit him up and was like, oh, can you come like at between five and six? And he was like, yeah. I said, do I need to hire another tasker to help you build the stuff? He's like, no, I can do it all by myself. Like, I'm pretty quick with these things. And he is $67 an hour. So I don't know how many hours it's gonna take him, but either way, even if it's three or four hours, it's still cheaper than $675. So that's that. Um, I'm super excited to get this room. Looking like a closet, looking like a closet, baby. Yes, yes. This is the overview of this room. Now, the Pox closet system that I got, they are high because I have high walls. Um, and it's going to be from here to here. It's a corner, and then it goes all the way down. And then I did get the Alex drawer or dresser, whatever, and I measured it perfectly to go either right here or right here. This is the last little things I need to get out of here. Um, but I don't know what I'm gonna do. So basically I have the floating shelves and I was gonna make this whole wall shoe wall and then the desk just be right there. But then I don't know if the desk should be right here and just at the top like store, I don't know. He's gonna come in here and do it. So. <laughs> I'm excited. My dream closet. And then of course, I do not know how I lived in a one bedroom apartment because I feel like even my freaking three bedroom, I have stuff like everywhere. But as soon as the closet is set up, like, well, my closet's pretty organized in here. A pretty organized closet kind of with the shoes at the bottom. Um, and then, but I still have more clothes. So this closet would be perfect for me. I really need a walk-in closet. So I just was like, I'm making a dedicated room in my house. A closet, bitch, okay? So once that's set up, I'll be able to organize more clothes and actually put them places and put them in drawers more than what I have now. And then I probably do need to like have a pal that's like a getaway pal, I know. I know. I am washing clothes right now too. Harlem follows me around and helps me out and stuff. Um, and yeah, that's just what I've been doing all day. Um, I do need to eat something. Once they bring this stuff up, I'm a shower and I am going to um, just fix me some rice. I made steak and rice last night, but I ate all the rice. So I'm just making some more rice and maybe do some broccoli. Um, and one of these days I need to take the Z Gallery stuff back. But other than that, everything's great. I'm excited. My closet's coming, coming up my closet. It's coming. It's coming, 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 it's coming. Here is my meal. I got some steak, some salmon, rice, and string beans. Um, the pieces have came. I am just waiting for the um, installer to get here. So it's all these pieces really high up. <laughs> so freaking high. I'm super excited to see this come to life. Um, 
but yeah, I'm about to chill until he gets here and eat my dang on food. My room looks a mess. Don't judge it, but uh, this is what I'm doing until he gets here. All right, y'all. So it's like 1 a.m. in the morning. Um, the guy came and he just left. Although, Harlem, hush. Although I basically was like, I was going to get two taskers to come do this task. But he insisted that, hi. He insisted that like he could do it by himself and he doesn't work with other people and that he's fast. Um, no. So clearly he's never did something of like this big task before. Something like this big task before. So it is almost complete, but it was just like this room looks so much worse than this. I've been going back and forth downstairs taking cardboard boxes, but it is almost finished. It's just like the little details inside of the shelving is not completed um <clears throat> and then this one is not deep enough so this is actually a shoe shelf which i didn't know so i'm like hmm i don't know if i'm gonna keep these because i needed more space like this for clothes to go into oh uh, let me show you how many boxes there's stuff out here these i didn't know they were so dang going big um so this is more cardboard boxes There's so many dang old cardboard boxes i'm tired of going up and down the elevator trying to take you to the big room harlem is tired of being locked up because you know he don't know how to act with other you know cardboard box and papers and people in the house i don't think these are going to fit uh, this is going to fit, but the hangers won't hang. <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> um, so I'm just cleaning up in here a little bit because it's just looking a mess. He said, don't touch anything, but it was so, like all the boxes that's at the front right now was in here. So you can imagine how bad this looks. Some stuff might have to get returned because... He said he's going to come back tomorrow, supposedly. Harlem, you can't be in here, boo-boo. Your ass don't know how to act. I thought they were going to be heavy. So I kind of did, I wanted the floating shelves right here just because I felt like this was going to be like kind of claustrophobic. Uh, the floating shelves couldn't have been right there either. Good morning guys. I am up. I'm like in my PJs and bonnet. Don't mind me. Also, I'm trying to pull my lashes off. So if my lashes look wild, listen, I'm going to my lady that I've been going to because the lady that I went to now, she just does them too long and I don't know. I'm just go back to the old lady that i used to go to and she'll be at my house i believe my appointment is like nine in the morning but she'll be at my house um okay anyways i have to put up the baby gate because harlem will come in here and pick up all of these pieces but i've been in this room just moving stuff around and then um i did like kind of set up the desk area i don't know if i want it right here or to move it right there um the only thing that i'm kind of sad about but i guess everything happens for a reason is only these two shelves are big enough to have hangers, but these ones are just like shelves. So this one will be shoes, but it's not like deep enough to put hangers. And I thought that that was gonna be more closed storage. So I only have these two right here for clothing, which I'm like, hmm, I have a lot of clothes. So that was the whole point of doing this. And I don't have as many, sh I mean, I have shoes that would fill up this, but they kind of have a place right now. Um, I need to get like a circular mirror. I just brought this in here because you guys know I don't have lighting and stuff in the house. This goes in the living room. I have to figure out what I want to be in here. But um, I want like a circular mirror or the um, Impressions Vanity mirror <clears throat> that has all the lights on it. It's like really glam. So I don't know what I want to do. Um, and I don't have shelving for these two because I got the wrong ones. So I need to go to Ikea and return the floating shelves that I got and then get the new pieces that I need to. Yeah. So I don't know when I'm going to do that, but it's a lot of pieces. 
So I would have to like take all that stuff downstairs and then wait for the Uber go. I feel like I need help with that. So I may not do that until like I have Craig or somebody here that can help assist or just rent a car or something because I don't got time. I don't got time today. Uh, oh, I'm making pasta. Um, I like my spaghetti to be very meaty. So I did three different types of meat and I'm about to put the um, sauce in. So this is my meats. I have ground beef, Italian sausage, and then pork sausage. And the water, waiting for the water to come to a boil so I can do the noodles, which I'm doing the bow tie noodles. And yeah, then I'll be able to have lunch and figure out if I'm about to do this IKEA move. <laughs> I probably am, because I want to get it over with and have this guy come back out and install it so we're finished. <laughs> I'll be finished with decorating. All right, guys, I am about to do my makeup. My lash lady just left. So these are what my lashes look like now. Um, I feel like they look so much more natural. I like the more natural, you know, soft uh, fake eyelashes. So yeah, I basically like my eyelashes to look like Demi Wispies. I love like the Wispies and stuff from Ardell. So that's how I like my fake eyelashes to look when I get them done. And um, I will, I will add lashes to these. So whenever I like go to the club, I'll just put another set of Demi Wispies like on top and they're like really full. But I like them to look natural and not long and like look fake, so. So yes guys, I am getting ready to go hang out with um, the twins, um, Justin, one of my other friends, Chris, he's like getting his ears pierced today and he wants me to go with him. <laughs> so, um, I need to leave now so I can go with Chris to get his ears pierced. Then, it, since I'm being like the Times Square area, I'm going to link up with the twins and Justin to go bowling. So, um, hopefully tomorrow... I can get one of my friends to drive me to Ikea to drop off this stuff and get new shelving for back here because I'm so excited for this to com be completed and like clothes and stuff to be behind me and I can like set up the camera here and we can get ready and do girl talk and all that stuff. <gasps> yes, it's gonna be lovely. <clears throat> it's 69 degrees in New York. So the weather is like getting colder and colder. So I don't know what I'm gonna wear. I'm probably wearing some jeans. I need to find like a cute top. Actually, while I am in like the Times Square area, I actually um, want to pick up some things from some stores. I feel like I don't have a lot of shirts. Okay, I redid my frontal last night. I've been doing my frontal installs by myself because uh, my hairstyle is like to play. So, I've just been doing it by myself. Alright y'all, say it ain't so, but it is officially fall time. I'm sorry. I'm not about to get sick again because people want to act like it's still summertime. It is fall. I'm wearing my scarf because it is cold outside. So this is my first official fall outfit. A nice Chelsea boot, which is a staple. Um, some jeans. I have on a sweater underneath here. Um, a nice scarf to tie in some colors to the outfit and this like camo coat and a brown bag, Louis Vuitton brown bag. Um, but yeah, this is my first official fall outfit. I curled my hair so my hair has curls and body. This is Brazilian body wave with a matching frontal. So um, my longest length is 26, if you guys are wondering. So yeah, um, I called an Uber. Because I just was not getting on a train today. I just refused. So I'm going to Uber there. Harlem, you ready to be put up, boo-boo? You ready to be put up? All right, guys. I just got into the city. I'm with Chris. We're about to go get his ears pierced. Come on. You going to hype me up like that? Yeah. Yeah. Get ready. <laughs> <laughs> so the reason why he's scared is because of his parents. You got Caribbean parents, man. <laughs> Shit don't work. So he's don't gonna work. wear a hoodie around it for them. <laughs> I think it's this way. Alright, alright, I ain't scared, I ain't scared. Justin in a 
twins calling me like, where are you at? I'm like, listen, I'm trying to do two things at once. Then she won't have to phone to the air acting like, like acting I'm trying like, to find a place. Like trying to find a place. I'm coming. <laughs> Why I am coming. I'm just kind of walking in the wrong way, and then I got to reroute back the there other it way. Is. Right there. Oh, you see it? <laughs> Hilarious, y'all. Boy, it's a little pinch. I already did it to him. Not think. That was tighter. Why are they not so chicken? Boy, babies come in here and get this done. I don't even wear it. You want me to come? Just do it. Just do it. With the boys now. We got our shoes, our bowling shoes. This is the Chinese. Um. Oh, probably rock here. Hey, Justin. Hey, Justin. I was What I think is really cool about this bowling alley is they have the different countries. So this is Paris, or is it New York? Oh, that's the Canadian club. Oh, wow. They even have uptown and downtown lanes. Wow. Well, it's not morning. It's actually almost like 2 o'clock in the evening. But it's a late start, so don't, don't mind me. So me and Justin and the twins were out last night hanging out. Justin's still here, and he's going to come with me to Ikea to, like, switch out some of the pieces in, for pieces. Switch out some of the things that I got that I had, didn't use and get the ones that I need. So we're about to do that now. Um, all the stuff is at the front door ready to be taken down and I'm about to move the car. So, um, I got, I got the keys to the car, keys to the car, key, keys to the car. Ooh, what is he got? Wait one of the what? One of the little white things. That you have on the floor over there. This dog is seriously a headache. Lord. Don't let them sell you all of their dirt. It all will come back once the tables turn. Boulder, go boulder. Alright, so we got the right stuff at IKEA this time. We come over to get a snack because Missy is gonna be in town in just a few. Why Justin? No, go ahead. <laughs> Why did Justin get two hot dogs and pizza? That's supposed to be just a snack. But no. Alright guys, so we are in the car coming from IKEA. <laughs> Jayla drives crazy, y'all. What? Lies. You're crazy. lying. She almost got us into an accident. Man, you real. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm playing. I'm playing. You actually are a good driver. Down to 164th Street. I'm a little nervous though, so you know I got my seatbelt. Get extra out. On. Do you have your seatbelt on? Oh, seatbelt. Good. Dang, got seatbelt on. Where are we coming from? Oh, we gotta go we get. We went to Missy's. IKEA. Yeah, well, we're gonna no. wait for Missy. Oh yeah, we wait for Missy. No, Missy. Oh, Missy's gonna be in town. Yeah, 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 Missy's
she ain't text me. Let me see if this girl like. Yo, IKEA is so huge. Yo. Oh my god. This is my first Please time. Please just order online. This no. is our first time going to IKEA. Both of us. Ridiculous. Too much. There's like a maze in there. Literally. Mm. Literally. Damn, you see, I would just ask you certain questions. Oh my god, you see what I mean? She almost fucking killed me. What? I'm in my lane. She almost fucking killed me, y'all. Oh my god. Look what the wind blew in. How long you miss Auntie Miss? I did miss him. We're not beefing today, okay? Yeah. We're not beefing. You been sis? You have to like I just, I saw, just you. saw you. <laughs> Guys, the closet is done. I finished building it. Justin, shut up. This. <laughs> okay, so clearly I need to get two more, but. What is that suit, Madam? Isn't that mad? That cool? is bomb. I was talking about that for a little bit. Oh, yeah. Boots can go right there. This is going to be jewelry, it's going to be a top that's clear. That's gonna go on top of this. Um, this was installed for scarves. So it pulls out like that. Um, I'm gonna get an additional shelf down here. I need two of these boards. And then I am gonna have storage up here. I want like something, like some really nice, like one, two, three bins or something. Um, but I'm excited. So the last thing in this room that I want you guys' advice on is I was going to paint this wall or I was going to do a wallpaper. You guys know I have a wallpaper that was going to go up in another one of my rooms. I don't know if I should do it for this room or just get something else um, and then put a mirror right here. Um, and then the last thing would to get an ottoman and like a nice little rug to sit on like you know when you come in and if you're trying on shoes or something so that will go right here and that's really the last thing for this room the closet is done the closet's done Harlem the closet's done Harlem the closet's basically done the closet's basically done all right guys my closet is basically finished i am about to head out to go to ikea and z gallery again um just a few missing pieces but this is the overall closet i can't wait for you guys to see it with like the clothes and my jewelry in here and um my lights that go on my desk or whatever so this is the completion of this room basically <laughs> You guys will have a entire apartment tour, furnished apartment tour, as soon as I get the last touches of like the things in the living room, my bedroom, the guest room is done, and then in here. So I will give you guys like a completely furnished, like you guys have been with me like trying to decorate my place. So it's only right that I gave you guys like all together, all the rooms. So I'm about to end this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.